Come here, come here. The money is here. Give me the brother. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, here. Give me some. Yeah, here. Sorry, sorry. Brother here is genuine. A thousand pounds. Hold it. Show it. Show it. Show Simple test. No, 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 no. No, count it. It's my brother. I don't want TAT, guys. Great. Check it, check it. Check it. I'm here. I'm here today. Abdul Razak, a business oh, man, oh gave me a thousand pounds. Three, thousand pounds four, he gave me five, for a six, test. Seven, if Bob is a true eight, scholar, nine, he will know today. He's a man of his word. If he passes the test, Abdul Razak said, if Big Bob passes this test, he can take a thousand pounds. He will know. If he passes it, it's a test. Now the test now is. Hold on. <laughs> we are telling the Christians that the Quran, one author. So what's the topic? The Quran, By the way, he's got it. He's got it. The, the Quran, who's got the money? Who's got the money? Moses got the money. Moses got the money. Moses got the money. Moses got the money. What is the money? Moses, Moses, give it to me. Moses, give it to me. Give the money out, please, man. Moses, 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 this man is a broke, broke man from Camberwell. <laughs> Give me a brother. Broke man from Camberwell. So here, we are telling the, we are, no, the Quran, there's only one Quran. Yeah? The Quran was revealed to the last and final messenger, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. One Quran, one author. We are told that the Bible, 40 people wrote the Bible. 40 people. We want to know who are these 40 people. Okay. So you want to debate that? No, 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 no debate. Guess what? He has to tell me the names of the 40 people. Who are the authors of the Bible? You believe in the Bible? Ah, that's what I'm saying. You yeah. want to know the authors of the Bible. Yeah, yeah, the Bible. yeah, yeah. No Googling. And I'm, I'm going to do the harder part. Look, I'm going to do the harder part. Look, 66 wrote the Bible. He will never come no, back. 66 wrote the Bible. I'm going to quote each book, give you what, how many chapters and how many verses in each book. And all he has to tell me, for example, the first book of the Bible is uh, Genesis. I'll say Genesis has got 50 chapters. 1,230, 1,533 verses, you say Moses. Second book of the Bible, the book of Exodus. Exodus has got 40 chapters and 1,213 verses, Moses. We go on up to Genesis. We want to know who are the authors of the Bible. You believe in the Bible, you know the authors. If you can pass that, 1,000 pounds. Abdul Razak, 1,000 I will do the harder part <laughs> of my head, the harder part. All the books. From Genesis to Revelation, I don't even have to look at it. I'll name the books, how many chapters, how many verses. All you have to do, tell me the authors. We know who are these people. Okay, okay. If the Bible is a word of God, inspired, 40 people wrote it, who are they? My African brother here, voodoo man. You can come if you pass the test. Tell them pants by voodoo man here. African man. You read the Bible, you pass it. My friend. One thousand pounds here. No, what is for voodoo. Brother has got thousand pounds. What is Bob? He's run away. Who wrote the Bible? And you're a liar. You know you're a liar. Pass it forty thousand pounds. You're a liar. Who wrote the Bible? You are interested. Who wrote the Bible? You are interested in money. Man, give me the money, give me the church. I don't want money. I'm giving to you. I'm not like you. Who wrote the Bible? Who wrote the Bible? The Bible is written by men and the how many, inspiration how many people? of the Spirit of Who God. Who are they? The number is irrelevant. Oh, is irrelevant. So anyway, that's, that's not important. You know, that's not important. Why is it important? Hey, Bobo, 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 Right, are you going to give me the money? It's a test. No, it's getting three chances and then oh, I'm going to pay There you go, there you go, no. there you go. Pay pay pay. There you go. Pay pay. Pay. Hold on. on, hold on, pay for what? For this debate. Why would, I, oh, no, no. Why would I pay for debate? Because oh, on multiple oh, occasions... Hold on, hold on. Oh, shut up then. Okay. Okay. On multiple occasions, you have said, I will give you... Five hundred pounds, three hundred pounds to debate me. Four hundred pounds. Repeatedly, he has said that he's okay, going wait, to wait, do wait, that. Wait, wait. Because, because, guys, honestly, as anyone who's ever witnessed slamming in a debate, it's a waste of time. You never listen to okay, what you're saying. Well, I expose you. So, I are you why. going to do that? Let, let, let me talk. Let me talk. Let me talk. Right. Go on. I want to, it, it, it says all in the I'm video. I'm going soon, JC. No, it's in video. It said. 
bring a proof next week if you're truthful that I say, Bob, okay, if you come and debate with me, this far from the past. You come and debate with Muslim for free. It will be imbecilic and moronic of me. What did he say? say he said he'll debate you on the authorship of the Bible and give you 1,000 pounds. What do you know? Cash in hand. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. Give me the money. No, good money. Give me the money. Oh, no, I want it in my hand. No, 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 no. He have in my hand. He have a question. In my hand. The camera is here. We give it to the lady. We give it to the lady. Hold on. After that, you give it to him. Give me the money. You want to see it? It's not a debate. I want it in my hand. Or I don't debate him. No, no, it's yeah, that, okay. What? <laughs> Give me the money in my hand. You see? Wait, wait, wait. Ten, no, 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 no. Nine, no, 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 no. Eight, oh, seven, I'll give it to a cameraman. Give it to a cameraman. Cameraman. Three, face me. One, one, one. Oh, look, he's a fake. He's got to go. He's got to go. You just give it to me. He's got it. Give me the money. No, don't show it to me. He's giving me the money. He's too full now. Give me the money. Look, look. No, there we go. You had your chance. He said it. Give it. He said it. Why is it? They're all saying that they're going to give me the money. Wait, you, sir, a dishonorable wait, listen, man, I'll debate anyone but you. No, 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 we are not debating. Your word means <laughs> nothing. Why is the proof? Wait, you are wait, not wait, a man. Why is the proof? You are. Why is the proof? You are an undignified. Why is the proof? What a liar! Your word means nothing. Why is the proof? Your word means nothing. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Everybody, stop it! No, 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 why are you hold afraid it. to hold it? Someone hold it! Hold it! Hey, give it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. JC, take the money. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Take the money. Everybody hear it. Notice he doesn't want to give it no, to no, no. JC. <laughs> give it to JC. No, no, wait, wait, wait. Give the money to what, JC. What, 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 give the money to the sister. I will kick one. Give it to her. Let's kick one first. What is it all about? Don't, don't give it to you. What is it about? Don't give me a vote. Okay, what did I say? 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 Oh, I'll give you this money. Look, the money is here. my hand out, he doesn't give it to me. Look, he wants to give you some money. Right, well, give it to me then. What is it about? What is it about? He wants to give it to me. What is it about? What is it about? Okay, he's wasting my time. I've got better things to do than waste my life on Lamin. He wants to give you... Waste of time, Lamin. This is first one. Waste of time. Bob, Bob, Bob. He wants to give you some money. In, my hand in case you answer the question, I'll answer if any question fail, you like. If you fail to answer what the question, you, you, don't, you don't deserve the money. Oh, thank you. If you oh, thank you. Oh. If you answer I'm, the not, question. I'm not going to waste my time debating. Oh, I'm not going to waste oh, my time. Liar. Liar. See, liar. his word means nothing. Liar. Can we do liar. the cutbacks that show him liar. promising liar. the money? <laughs> Everyone, Anybody tune into SoCo Films this guy is a liar. Is and you'll see Lamin again, on multiple I'm occasions again. offering money to a debate but never giving it. Hey, well, put it in my hand then. Yeah, put, it. put it in my hand. You see, he's lying. Put it in my hand. Put it in my hand. We'll have a debate. We'll have a debate. It's not a debate. Who are you about to debate? He's not a debate. Yo! He wants to say be quiet a minute. He said test quiet. He said test. Wait, wait. Look, say. Say it. It's not about the debate. Who actually believes? Look, look. Put it in my hand. No, he put it in my hand. He just put it in my hand. He just put it in my hand. He doesn't want to give me the money. Ladies and gentlemen, Saeed is someone who I find to be dishonest. I find him to be rude. Oh, any of you in any doubt that no matter what I say, he will say at the end of it that I fail. Isn't Anybody that exactly what will happen? Look, you're fake. No, <laughs> I'm not the Anybody one who goes around. Anyone can hold it in my hand. Anybody, Anybody can hold it. Just you. you just gave it to Leon, and then you took it no, back from Leon. Leon won't give it to you. Leon, hold it. No, 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 put it in my hand. No, no, pass it. No, put it in my hand. It's a test. Put it in my hand. It's a test. Put it. No, 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 I'm wasting my time. It's a test. No, 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 Hello, He comes up to me and he says, I'll offer you money, and then he walks away. He won't give, actually give you money, but he says, debate me for money. Ciao! Wrap up.
you were saying it's like the arabization stuff. Yeah. I wonder if you can kind of like go through it again to kind of understand the points you're making and where your, what your sources are. Okay. Instance. Right. So, uh, very briefly, because I am honestly trying to. Know. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. In simple words, wherever Islam and Sharia law has dominated, the native cultures have been progressively Arabized. And we see examples of that in Egypt, the examples of that in Namibia, examples of that in Lebanon, examples of that in Syria, examples of that in Palestine, examples of that in Turkey. We, what you see is a, a, a continuing influence of uh, Arabization that goes hand in hand with Islamization. And, and the consequence of that is if the church is willing to accept Islamization, then it, it is willing to, to see its own defeat. So Christians have to rise up and push back against Islamization. Not just here in the UK or in Europe, but right across the entire world. So I have one question to ask this. Um, and then I don't know if you do it as well. So I think you look at other Viking cultures and where, or Roman culture where they had their religions in, in, their, in their face and then Christianity took over. Yes. Take it off of the Vikings and die yeah, out. Yep. Really. Right, well let's look, let's look at that. When when Christians when Christians converted Scandinavia, we're about to be interrupted. We're about to be interrupted. Well, will you tell Lamin the reason why I stopped? Yeah, because he's going to say that I lied now when I said I was here. So you correct him. He's got, he's got something to tell you. He's got something to tell you. He's got something to tell you. You are right. Put it in my hand. You are right. Put it in my hand. You are right. It's a fair preacher. So put it in my hand. Taki, you are right. Put it in my hand. You are right. So put it in my hand. Put it in his hand. Just settle the whole no, argument and put it in my hand. What's up? I can't believe you're afraid of. You have to pass the test. What are you afraid of? Does anyone actually believe that no matter what I say or how much evidence I give, he will conclude that I passed the test? He will run away. Do you actually believe that this is a test that's possible? I don't believe him. Zero. Anyway, we were talking. Don't believe him. Tell them back. Tell them back. Tell no one is really in front of you. <laughs> you're not. Who Thank you. Come on, I mean. Look at you. Look at you. What the thing is going now? Where's my money? Before I came, you were Sorry, this is what he does. He does this all the time. This is the conduct. This is the conduct of the Dawah team. This is the conduct of the Dawah team. Are they teams? Yeah, they're groups. They work together. Abdul Razak, Aki. I don't want to say this. This is my second time here. This is very confusing. But you notice, you notice how their dean has failed him. Like, it doesn't make them... This, this is the kind of supremacism. This is the kind of supremacism that we have to oppose. This is the kind of supremacism that we have to push in. I literally stood there and said, let's do it, but somehow that's not doing it. So, boring. Anyway, so in terms of, in terms of what that means for the church, is that as Christians, we have to stand up against that kind of Islam. Oh yes, sorry, my apologies, I got distracted. So like look when when we look at the conversion of the Viking people, yeah, what didn't happen, what did not happen was that Palestine or the normal cultures of Palestine became infused in Nordic culture. That didn't happen. So Nordic culture continued to be Nordic and it took on a, a, a rearrangement of human values based upon a Christian prism. But the Vikings didn't suddenly start to dress like first century Palestinians. They didn't have to start speaking Hebrew or Aramaic to be Christian. They could speak in their own language. They could continue their own Nordic cultures. But where, where, whereas Islam, whereas Islam, in Egypt, for example, they had they ended up losing their language. They ended up losing their sort of cultural norms um, and, and becoming increasingly Arabized. So that's essentially the point that I was making. And that means that if you don't want to be Arabized, you have to oppose Islamization. There you go. You see? Does that answer your question? I can follow along your logic. I can see that. God is not a mouse!
When they say Allah Akbar, Akbar in Hebrew means mouse. Ah. So when they say Allah Akbar, they're saying God is mouse. Which of course they're speaking in Arabic, but it's mocking an Islamic argument that, that uses uh, linguistic sounds that sound the same to make false points. So it's just mocking that. Anyway, bro, I'm gonna go. Yeah, take care. Are you a Christian? No, but I'm attending church more now. Fantastic. What I would encourage you to do, bro, is that you. I'm a very slow chicken. Um, is that you? You pick up your Bible and you start. God is not a mouse. So, so is you pick up your Bible and you you start to studying the faith about how to be a Christian. Yeah, I'm, I'm interested in the stories. Yeah. So I learned about Lazarus on Wednesday, um, the grave of Lazarus. Fantastic. Um, and then I think this Wednesday or Friday, I'm learning about like the Good Friday story. Well, that's um, brilliant. So, so you're part of a fellowship that's discipling you and they're teaching you this. Yeah, it's just like a local church, and they have brilliant. like a, they have like a, a, a sermon on a Sunday. Then on a week in a weekday, they have like a Q and A section. So they'll read a passage of the Bible. Yeah. And then you do Q and A's on what you think, what any questions it raises, and then just any further wider questions on the faith. Oh, fantastic. Well, if I can, if I can contribute to your growth in knowledge about the Christian faith, come and talk to me like you have today, and we'll go and we'll 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 discuss it yeah. away from Lamin, of yeah, course. No, I'm more than happy to. Do it. Thank yeah. you. I, 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 I quite like you. Do seem it's a very boisterous crowd. I know what it's like, but it's it's very different from the shouting side to it. I could, you make points as opposed to just shouting at people. Yeah. Which is why I wanted to talk to you. I try to. I only end up shouting when I can't get my voice heard. Yeah. By by the crowds, you know. Yeah. You've got, but, and you're very good at like the way you use your language. It points across. But you're you're going in a good way, and I'd encourage you to keep going in that way, to keep studying, because I guess the difference between a Christian. Let, let me just tell you quickly the difference between a Christian and a cultural Christian, because mm -hmm. you might have some claims to being a cultural Christian, but a Christian is one who owns their faith for themselves. They take responsibility for being a disciple of Christ and seeking to follow Christ in their own life. And, and the way that they do that is multifarious. And the, the Christian faith, a, a good Christ, the idea of a good Christian fellowship is one that is devoted to the apostolic teaching, so you're building your understanding of the world and your understanding of values on the uh, prophets and apostles. Yeah, You're building your worldview on what they teach. You have a devotion to the prayers because ultimately the Christian faith is about relationship with God. It is a devotion to the breaking of bread. That's the idea of remembering, in a Jewish sense, remembering that, that Christ died for our sins. Yeah, and that he brings about a new covenant and a new humanity in that new covenant. And someone who is devoted to the fellowship, which means that we're devoted to our brothers and sisters. And devoted means that it costs you something. That it costs you something to be it. Okay? Cultural Christians might just have the label Christian, but they have no commitment to the teaching, no commitment to the values, no commitment to applying it in their life, no commitment to standing up for their brothers and sisters. I guess, I guess so for me, it's one of the cases of I kind of realised that I was living my life as the way the stories teach, but I'm not theologically a believer. Okay. But I live my life with the stories in the world. Okay. So I, I struggle with the idea of like the heaven and hell are things. Yeah. That doesn't connect with me personally. Yeah. But I like the I like the, the story of Jonah and the <laughs> quite a lot. Um, and even like Lazarus, when I learned about the story and understood it, it, it helped me deal with another issue I was having to do with like being harsh now for a, a better good later on. Yeah. Kind of an argument. Yeah. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let you know. No, but just as a, a small point to that, um, is that ac accept what you can accept, because if you accept what you can accept and you claim it as your own, as your own beliefs, what you will find is that it then makes sense of the bits that you're not ready to accept, right? But you've got to own it. Don't just see it as some kind of intellectual inquiry that's done over there. You've got to say it right. This is what I believe. I believe this and you stand on it. You put your flag on the hill and you say, this is where I stand, right? And when you do that, what you'll find is that the other bits that mm, at, at this moment in time do not make sense will start to make sense when you look at those same things from that, point. From that hill mm. as opposed to this hill, mm. yeah? yeah? So accept what you can accept. Don't worry about convincing yourself to accept things you're not ready to. Accept what you can, but own it. And then when you own it, look at the same things you can't accept from that perspective 
and I bet you, you begin, they begin to make more sense. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Love you. Thank you. Love you. You look after yourself. Continue to grow in the faith, bro. We'll pray for you. And it was, it was Bill, and your name was JC. Nice to meet you, JC. Michael. So if, you come, if you come to the park again, come and grab us. Yeah. And my advice to you is since you're, you're new to the park and you're exploring the Christian faith, is don't try to defend Christianity in the park. Yeah, no, right? I wouldn't. I, yeah. I wouldn't. Because at the moment you're still learning. And have that humility to learn and to grow. And then maybe at some point in the future, you'll be in a position to defend the faith. Alright? Yeah. Take care. Yeah. You're going to have to walk in the broken one of